you know you dropped your shoulder on your right foot. You to take off your foot. There'll be a critique afterwards. Yes. Skating in front of the home crowd here, it is Japan's Takahiro Mura. He posted a personal best in the short program to sit third. He's actually coached by his father. And this is his second Grand Prix event this year, though a disappointing 10th at Skate America. the sport. He was a little outside the circle on that jump, but his upper body strength and the fact that he is recovering from a mistake that he does often so he knows how to fix it. But he sure did. Second quad attempt. This one needs to be in combination and it is. that those two quads weren't fantastic, but you see there's a level of expectation in the men's event. We've got a gentleman who just did two quads in a row, and we're wondering what else he's got. How about a big triple axel? Nice. Oh, that doubles the sow. Should have been a triple. Spin will cost him a level or two, I think. Stopping the rotation and starting again is a big no no. Well, in the men's singles event, it's usually not the spins that make or break you, but you don't want to throw away points. No. spin because their lack of flexibility or they just feel it tuckers them out yes. and really uses a lot it's of energy exhausting. for that extra 1.4 points or whatever it might be. I'd rather save that energy and go for that third quad. Which takes a lot less time. off of that loop. You seem to flat foot that edge. The depth of the Japanese men for the last few years has been incredible. In fact, we were talking earlier about uh, the one that did 25 quads in one season. Yeah, that was, um... come on, Kurt. It wasn't Takahashi. I'll have it for you in a bit. It'll come to us. It'll come to us. He's gone now, not not even skating now. And then there's Yuzuru, who's at the top of the, the world. Yeah, Machida. That's what it was, Tatsuki Machida. Tatsuki, that's right. That's it. Arsenal of choreographers, Olympic dance champion Charlie White, and Olympic bronze medalist, Canadian Jeffrey Buttle. Choreographing for this is a pretty good pedigree. Mm -hmm. 
Takahito is a bit of a challenge because he doesn't seem like the kind of skater that morphs and blends to a different style of choreography very well. So, a challenge for them. Takahito Mura of Japan will not be going to the Grand Prix final this year with his 10th place at Skate America, but he did go last year and he finished fifth. But we'll see where he places here in Japan. More coming up on Road to Olympic Games. Yes, Boy Yang Jin, how many quads will we see him do? But Yuzuru Hanyu looking to make even more history after doing so in the short program. Don't go anywhere as you continue to watch Road to the Olympic Games. Meantime, back to figure skating here in Japan. Takahiro Mura of Japan just up in his skate, sitting in third after the short. Great height. And there's a timing that goes down in the knee, and on the way up, you hit the takeoff point. He doesn't do that. He actually jams that toe pick into the ice, and he is so strong that he creates his height a little differently than what I would call the elegant jumpers. Mm. He's got tremendous upper body strength. Didn't quite get around that time. He has a big lurch to his landings, kind of like Lexi Agudin used to land down low, and there's not something very regal about it, but it's exciting, you know, and it look, looks like work, looks athletic. He will need a score of 147.35 to take the lead from the American. Let's see if he makes the home crowd cheer, and yes, that will be the case, 153.92, and he will currently sit atop the standings there. Get ready for the next skaters. Pretty elegant kiss and cry area, isn't it? Japan always has the best kiss and cry. It's like outer space sometimes. Yeah. 